Well, simplest answer is we want to be more competitive in the league. Um, obviously, doing those things help us win more games. I thought last year um, with a little bit of uh, you know issue with uh, penalties, power play wasn't quite good enough. So those are areas of concern for us. Um, overall, I think we've improved our skill level going into this year. So we hope that that translates into more wins for us. Uh, I think it's another great division. I know last year we were in the Central, now we're back in the Midwest with you know teams like Fairbanks, Cooley, Janesville, um, you know, in Springfield and Kenai. Um, a lot of those teams have had a, a great track record in the league. Obviously, Fairbanks is the defending champion, so we're in there. Uh, division now, but uh, you know, very competitive league across the board. Um, you know, it's just a little different look for us this year. The Central was great last year. Uh, the Midwest will be another great division. So, looking forward to that competition. At the end of the year, we stated that our goal is to get to the Robertson Cup Championship in Edina, and that's still our goal. Um, we've stated that to our players all off season, and you know, obviously, there's a long road to get there, but you know, that's the ultimate end goal. Um, you know, for us, it starts uh, Monday the 29th, and looking forward to building towards that goal. Well, again, I think it reaffirms that our league is a great option for players to get to college hockey, uh, not just college, but uh, pro in the NHL, as we saw last summer um, in the draft. So, um, you know, for us, I mean, it's a great opportunity for kids to come in in a great environment, be seen, and, and um, develop and move, move towards their Division I or Division Three scholarship opportunities. Well, obviously, there's a lot of hockey going on, and uh, it's a great opportunity for our guys to get in front of scouts and, and fans in the area. Um, another opportunity right down the road for for uh, families and friends to come watch, uh, you know, watch our league. Um, you know, brings in teams from all over the country, and obviously, it truly is one of the uh, largest and most unique events in all of junior hockey. Well, obviously, the city of Richfield here has been great for us. Um, you know, with the partnership we have with them. Uh, obviously, the larger, you know, Twin Cities Metro. There's a ton of players here and a ton of hockey. It's obviously, uh, you know, a hockey hotbed that we enjoy being a part of. And you know, uh, with our roster, you see a lot of guys from the area. Um, you know, they have an opportunity here to showcase their skills and, you know, one of the biggest things that for us is location. A lot of NHL and college scouts come through our building, so that's a, a great addition, whether it's uh, for us or the opponent that we're playing each night. So the exposure for kids uh, playing in our, our market is great. Well, it is the only Tier 2 Junior League in the country, which serves as a great opportunity for players that are looking to play college hockey. Um, whether it's players moving on to the professional ranks, college hockey, or even coaches moving on, it's a great great training ground for players and coaches um, to, to learn and, and be a part of the game in, in, in the U.S. Um, you know, with that, obviously, you see the record number of commitments, um, the growth of the league, um, and I, I believe, you know, obviously that starts with the owners that we have in the league, um, front office staff and people that are helping to, to guide the North American League and its other leagues to, uh, to success. Well, we want to play a fast game, uh, play with skill, play with passion. Um, we're obviously trying to rebuild the way we play compared to the last couple seasons. Um, we have a lot of talent here locally, a lot of kids with puck skills that we're trying to you know, implement into our system. Um, excited to obviously get started here next Monday and uh, looking forward to uh, reaching our goal there.